It's embarrassing. I like to kill him softly. From a distance. Not close enough for feelings. Don't like feelings. Don't want to think about them. That's hitman Brad Pitt talking about his theory about taking out a target. The movie is called Killing Them Softly. Our movie guy Aaron Lafferty is here with the take a to take a look at this and two other new movies opening this weekend. Yes, we've got, um, ironically, all the wide releases this weekend are mm -hmm. rated R. Oh. So pushing ahead to my picks, those are PG. So oh. we'll balance it out for you. Thank nice. you. Okay, okay so what do you think of this? Brad Pitt, big money. Um, Big winnings at the box office. I, I think it'll it'll be okay, but because of the rated R, it's going to hold it back a little bit. Oh, okay. Um, this is a movie that some people have been looking forward to. Basically, he's a hitman. Um, three crooks who didn't really know what they were doing. Uh, they rob a mob card game, and with the economy being what it is, the mob card game being shut down means they don't have money coming in. So Brad Pitt is set in to restore the card game and restore order. So. They can get their money flowing again. Okay, you haven't seen this, but what are you hearing for reviews on this? I'm hearing it's, it, you know, it's pretty good. I okay. mean, I, I wouldn't say it's necessarily an Oscar-worthy kind of movie, but definitely entertaining. If if you like crime mob movies, which you know, there's certain cult following for those movies. Okay, mm -hmm. sure. Okay, so what else do we have? Um, we also have uh, the Collection, which is a horror movie. Think kind of in the Saw franchise kind of okay. thing. We have a uh, a serial killer. He um, he kidnaps people and he does all these kind of crazy trap, uh -oh. booby trap kinds of things. Um, and one guy that has escaped him is helping police find somebody who was recently kidnapped by him. Hmm. So, oh, interesting. Um, it's actually getting thriller-ish. Yeah, more horror. Oh. It, this is R for all the violence, obvious, probably obvious and reasons. So yeah. Okay. And Anna Karenina. Anna Karenina only at Celebration North. Um, it's based on the Leo Tol Tolstoy novel. Um, Getting pretty good reviews. This was uh, in limited release. It's getting kind of an expanded release this weekend. Uh, Kira Knightley, as we were saying, does a lot of period. <laughs> she does a lot these of days, period so. stuff. Yeah. But this is something that I might go see because I love literature and Anna Karenina, so well known. And I think you know right. this could be a surprise. At right. The box I, th office. I think it'll do okay. But again, it's rated R and it's in limited release. It's only at Celebration North in West, West Michigan, so okay. it won't bring in the money. Maybe per screen, but it's not enough screens to really pull in the money. Okay.